all right guys you are welcome to my channel today i'll be teaching us on how to use the mesos browser and also the kiwi browser okay so these are web theory browsers that has lots of features because through them you can actually uh, it has the, the the ability to connect uh desktop mode like some of the project that that requires you using laptop you can use them you can use the desktop uh, mode uh, uh, feature to actually mitigate that uh, that process so instead of you using laptop for those who cannot afford laptop you can use the web3 browser the mesos browser or the kiwi browser to actually navigate that all right and also the fascinating thing about this uh, um, browser is that it has an inbuilt wallet okay so with it you can actually connect your wallet easily all right your crypto wallet like your trust wallet metamask and the rest so it has tons of wallet in it so let's open the mesos browser now so the first thing you do let me open a new tab for it for this all right the first thing you do you just ensure you log in your gmail account so just go ahead and log in your gmail account okay so after you log in your your gmail account you search for chrome you search for chrome extensions all right you search for chrome extension store so you just search it all right it has opened now so you can click on this one that said install and manage extension so you can just click on it so that you can carry you straight to the store all right so you click on chrome chrome uh, web stores you just click on it all right so <clears throat> just go ahead and zoom so the reason why my gmail is here is because i've logged in my gmail all right so that's why i said first thing you do log in your gmail because you will not be able to download any of those uh, extensions so you see your search by here uh, just zoom out zoom in rather search for maybe okx let's search for okx uh, uh, extension you can see that's OKS extension. So I've installed it already. So go ahead and install OKS extension. Then you search for Phantom. Phantom. Okay. Search for Phantom. Then you install it. You can see I've installed it because these are the, these are some of my popular extension I'm using. You search for MetaMask. MetaMask. All right. So this is MetaMask. I've installed it. You can see installed. Guys, you search for trust wallet. So these are some some of the popular wallets I've installed in my uh, this thing in my Mesos browsers. Okay, you can see I've installed that of trust wallet as well. Installed. Okay. So after you install that, you can click here. You are seeing here. 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 Click on it. Then you can see all the wallets I have installed so far. I have installed Phantom, Trust Wallet, Leap Wallet, SafePal, OKS, and MetaMask. These are my popular uh, wallets. I have them right in my as app from, that I download from Play Store, but I'm installing them here for flexibility's sake in case I have any farming project that, that demands me to connect wallet. I just use my, my, my Mesos browser to connect. Okay, So you can now import those uh, the ones you have in your metamask in your trust wallet app so you can import those phrases or you can create new accounts for them all right for simplicity's sake i will advise you to just import the airdrop wallet you already have in your metamask or trust wallet so you can import them in any of those wallets that you want to be using so if you are using if, if, if you are using okx uh trust wallet and metamask just go, on, go ahead and import your wallet into them and start using okay so if you want to farm any project it will be more easier for you to connect your wallet so you'll not be having issues anymore again all right so it's as simple as that so you can see projects i'm doing and most of them are connected to one or two of those wallets here all right so that's how it works so that's how mesos browsers work and uh, also the, the 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 second feature I like about the Mesos browser, I told you 
what the first one is uh, the wallet feature while the second one is the desktop okay so you can see the desktop feature for example if i click on this website now i have to switch to you can see just click this three dot dot here click on it and you will see the desktop uh, feature let me click it this is the desktop feature so it's more or less like you are using a laptop once you switch to the desktop feature okay so we are currently on the desktop view now All right so some project that demands you to change your desktop mode you can just go ahead and change it all right so the same thing applies to to um to kiwi browser okay so the same feature just go ahead and uh, log in your gmail after you log in your gmail just go ahead and search for chrome uh, chrome extension just the same way you did for for uh Mises browser so everything is still show and you connect your, your wallet you can see some of the wallet have installed right so it also has a uh, the desktop mode view okay so you can also switch to desktop mode, to desktop mode. Right? so that's all about this uh web tv wallet they are very powerful just go ahead and explore you will never have issue farming anymore thank you so much you can like and also comment on the videos